Hi, my name is Aaron Beaver, and this is Extreme. Something about being outdoors is, if you ever notice if you go for a walk out in the woods and whatnot, is you don't feel stressed. There's almost nothing stressful or anxious about being outside. Is when you're stuck here on campus constantly studying and worrying about the next test you gotta take, is it's not like that when you're out there. All you're worrying about is the now and being in it. It's nice. I live in Arizona. That's where I'm from. So we have two seasons, hot and hotter. So having this idea where it starts off warm in the summer, gets cooler in the fall, then starts snowing in winter, and starts back all over again is not something I'm quite used to. But early fall when the leaves start to change, it's nice and cool outside. That's pretty enjoyable. I remember we've been there twice, me, my dad, and my brother, we've been to Yosemite National Park over in uh, Middle California, and it's probably the most beautiful place I've ever been to. The main valley, Yosemite Valley, is just, it's, I can't even think of words to describe it. It's just something you have to see to believe. Things I really enjoy to do outdoors is rock climbing. I mean, I like to think that I'm into it a lot more than I actually am, but it's just something I tend to dabble in. It's a lot of fun. Out of the seven times I've almost died, three of them have been in like one place. <laughs> it's a uh, Joshua Tree National Park. It's in, also in California. Um, I like to go there and just climb up on top of all these cliffs and kind of jump around in these rocks and whatnot. And I remember. I got a little bit rim rocked, which is the phrase you say when you can't really go up and you can't really go down. And so I tried going down to see if I could get out where I was and I started to slip towards a little precipice. And thankfully, the granite is really rough and I was able to grab the rock with just the palm of my hand and just kind of keep myself from falling. But that was one of the more extreme trips I've ever been on. It's important to care about the outdoors because nothing that you care about, whether it's physical therapy, your job as a social worker, or as a policeman, really matters if the world we live in isn't inhabitable. If you don't care about the outdoors, then no one's going to care about saving it and preserving it. And once that's gone, what's left? If someone wanted to learn about the outdoors club and get involved with us, they could either contact one of the e-board members, me, or they could come to the business building, room 201. Tuesdays at 11 a.m. We have a meeting every single week and it's free to drop in.